Picaresque.ca, a documentary short series covering the art, design, music, and people that make up the modern Canadian Renaissance. Canadian art is important. I was thinking about that, looking at like this big frozen expanse of prairie and all these little silos poking up every so many miles. And it's like, that's what we are. We're, we're this big, huge space that is frozen half of the year. And that's, in a way, what's special about us. It's important that that's reflected culturally, you know, even if it's not commercially significant. It inspires people. It inspires the people who keep the economy moving and all the, you know, trucks bringing us food and that sort of thing. Working within the vast network of creative energy in Victoria, BC, picaresque.ca profiles real Canadians, passionately following their dreams within the Canadian arts and culture community. These are um, some of my one-of-a-kind um, plush creatures that I like to make. This is a gigantor one, so it's kind of like when a mushroom, you know, just grows abnormally large because of auspicious conditions. I'd love to get my stuff out there and just be more and more of a position to really bring to life the things I imagine. I'm a Korean-born immigrant who now living in Canada as a Canadian citizen. I give at least one show in summertime, two, three shows daily in order to share mankind of love and divine love. Let me say thank to Canada, the government, the people, and especially in this time, my hometown city, city of Victoria. An inspiring mix of artists, chefs, designers, and musicians enrich the Canadian landscape. Find them online at picaresque.ca. My name is Kenny J. Kim. My name is Liz Dempsey, a.k.a. Dina Tava. I'm Jeremy Fisher for picaresque.ca.